So the OnePlus 13 is almost confirmed to launch in China next month, which is about two months earlier than its expected launch time frame. We know that the high-end variant will get 24GB RAM with 1TB of internal storage and that would give the OnePlus 13 an edge over its rivals. The OnePlus 13 will be powered by the Snapdragon 8 Gen 4 and will come with many AI capabilities, and more RAM is required to run AI applications smoothly. Although 16GB RAM is more than enough, but a higher RAM variant would definitely give you an advantage if you are thinking to use your phone for a long time. The 24GB RAM variant isn't surprising since the OnePlus 12 also had 24GB RAM, but DCS claimed that this high-end variant will be more expensive than the OnePlus 12 which had a price tag of 5799 yuan, but the OnePlus 13 may cost somewhere between 6000 to 6500 yuan. In terms of design, the OnePlus 13 would not get any major redesign and it might look similar to the OnePlus 12. It is also rumored to come in a green vegan leather back option. The OnePlus 13 is confirmed to get BOE's second generation oriental display also known as BOE X2. It's a 6.8 inch 2K OLED display with 120Hz refresh rate with micro curves on all four sides. Now moving to the cameras, the main camera in the OnePlus 13 might be a 50 megapixel Sony LYT A28 sensor. The sensor will be paired with a 50 megapixel ultra wide angle lens and a 50 megapixel Sony LYT 600 periscope lens with 3x optical zoom. The battery will also see an upgrade. It will now be a 6000 mAh high density silicon battery. This new battery would last longer than the standard one. The battery will support 100 watt fast wired and 50 watt fast wireless charging just like the OnePlus 12. It will run on Color OS 15 for Chinese market and on the latest version of Oxygen OS for global market. So this is all we know about the OnePlus 13 and let me know what you think about this in the comment section down below. Thank you for watching. As always, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.